Hello, this is Mr. Gomez, and in this video, I am going to show you how to insert a link into your message. So, as you can see, I already have clicked the Compose button, and the new message window has popped up. And I've already typed in my recipient, so I'm just going to type in the subject. This is pretty useful when you want to share a website or some kind of link with someone else. Check out this cool and useful website. Now I'm going to go down to the message. As you can see right here, as I typed in the subject, the new message right here changed into the actual subject of the message, which is pretty useful. So I'm going to type my message here. Here we go. <laughs> Having some trouble spelling awesome there. Now, what I'm going to do is um, I need to find that link. So I already have the website that I'm going to use. So I'm going to click on this one. This is a page of tutorials that are all picture based. So if you want to learn how to use some more software, this is a good one to check out. So I'm going to share this with someone. I'm going to click on this address in the Omnibox. And I only need to do this once. As you can see, it will highlight. Now if I click it again, I can either click down here and then try to click it again. That's OK. Or I can triple click. I can rapidly click three times. And that will highlight it. Either way, you need to highlight it. I'm going to use the Windows shortcut to copy, Control C. And now I'm going to move over to my message and I'm going to highlight just one of these, yeah, two of these words here. I can highlight everything, but I just want to put the link right here where I highlighted it. So I'm going to go down here. I'm going to click insert link. As you can see, there's a small little pop up and you can do a couple of things here. Right here, this is telling you what you are going to highlight. So these are the two words that are going to be affected. And I'm going to click right here because I want to link to a web address not an email. So there we go. I use the Windows shortcut control V as in violin to paste the website in there. I'm going to click OK. And as you can see, a box popped up. So I have my link now, but it's also telling me that it's going to go to this link. And if I wanted to go there right now, I can just click on it. Now, if I wanted to change anything, for example, I put the wrong web address, I can change it. Or if I just want to start over, I can click remove and that will get rid of the link entirely. But I don't want to do that, so I'm just going to click off of it. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to send this off and click send. All right, there we go. So with that, I'm going to bring this message to a close, or this video to a close, and I will see you next time.